good evening and welcome to Beer Dad's Beer Reviews with me, Dave the Beer Dad. Back again for another shot at a beer review. <coughs> this one we're going to do is from Magic Rock. It's a collaboration with... Where are they? Collaboration with Stig Beggetts. Stig Beggetts. The smallest brewery in Gothenburg in Sweden. This can only be one thing. This is their New England IPA. And this is Stiggy Pop. Oh, Stiggy Pop. This weighs in at a massive, massive 7 point something percent. If I find it, I've lost it. 7.3. Says so round about there. Best before on this one is the 9th of June 19. Says so there. Again, the obligatory card art that you get from Magic Rock. This beer cost me that much. I love Magic Rock. I love New England IPAs, and they do some really good quality New England IPAs. I've had a fair few in my time for Magic Rock. To break this beer down, then, so we've got malt or gold promise, malted rye, malted oats, and acidulated malt. Hops are TC9 CT7. It's like a robot from Star Wars. Uh, Mosaic and Victor Vic Secret, uh, Cryo, Mosaic and Simcoe, Yeast are the WLP 066, London Fog, as I say, it is 7.3%. Uh, is there anything else that you need to know about? Oh, pour carefully, may contain sediment. So, looking forward to that for a bit, looking forward to this. Seen a few reviews on the old, uh, the old YouTube. Um, I'll give it a go. It's my turn. Let's pop this top. Let's get this big 500ml can into a glass. Give it a swish, see if we get any old uh, sediment out. Put the best of that in a minute. So what have we got? We have got ourselves a hazy, cloudy, from when I'm looking at it, it's burnt orange. When you're seeing it is an it is an orange beer, like a heavy orange juice. It's got two things of white head. Bubbles are all tightly compact, it's a little bit rocky across the top. Any sediment? Not under there whatsoever. That looks beautiful as new england ipas go that looks like it's going to be great let's get a nose let's see what we can smell oh that's nice mango lots of mango peaches and apricots and all that type of cake that you'd expect from a new england ipa there's a bit of dankness in there Bit of malt, touch of malt, but it's mostly fruity, bit of citrus too, but it's mostly malt, made mango, tropical fruit, mm. and it's beautiful dankness. Ah, nice, nice, that's gonna taste. Cheers. <clears throat> Light carbonation, nice body suit as well. It's I would say it's probably because I was describing it as for me, it's probably medium bodied. It's a little bit slick, velvety. Velvety is the right word actually. It's got, it leaves a nice velvety layer on your tongue, it's lovely. It's good for the taste. It's a little bit bitter. So I'll, I'll, so that's straight away. Then we're looking at sorts of oranges, lemons, citrus pith and, and zest. It's zesty. Um just comes through, but we've got still we still got the sweet by mango, it's a little bit complicated. Mm. It's an interesting beverage. It's really good. The dankness stay the dankness stays right till the end. Mm. Excuse me, and that's what you're left with. And quite frankly, it's great. It's really, really good. As a, 
a little bit gassy. As it, as it goes, it, it, it tastes really nice. Fruity, tropical fruity. Dank and bitter. Try on the back end. Absolutely fabulous. <coughs> Alcohol is well hidden. Um, there's a little bit. It was just a fraction of, a, of an alcohol there. But again, that could be down to, that could be more the dankness than anything else. But that is a quality beer. Sticky pot. Good name. Good beer. Malty. Malty. Ugh, malty. Bangoey. Mango. Orange. Lemon. Cause it, yeah, that's pith. Dankness. A little bit of malt. Everything you want in a new unit with IPA. <coughs> it's really, really tasty. Oh, we'll finish that in the, in, in the other room. Right. Stiggy Pop. Magic Rock. And... Stig Bates. Berg, Bergets. Stig Bergets. Don't like it. I do. Would I buy it again? Yes, I would. Would I it to friends? Yes, I would. It's got a beautiful, beautiful taste to it. The dankness just complements everything else that goes on inside that glass. When you, when you pour it, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's great gear. Yeah. So if you've had this beer, let me know what you think. Put a comment below. Uh, if you hit watch it for the first time, subscribe is here or here. That if you like it, that if you don't like the video. And I'll see you on the next one. Hey, Leo.